हेलो बच्चो सो लेट्स रीड दिस क्वेश्चन थ्री वैक्टर्स ए वैक्टर बी वैक्टर एंड सी वैक्टर सेटिस्फाई द कंडीशन ए वैक्टर प्लस बी वैक्टर प्लस सी वैक्टर इक्वल टू जीरो एंड वी हैव टू इवेल्युएट द क्वांटिटी म्यू व्हिच इज ए वैक्टर डॉट बी वैक्टर प्लस बी वैक्टर डॉट सी वैक्टर प्लस सी वैक्टर डॉट ए वैक्टर इफ वी हैव बीन गिवन दैट मॉड्यूलस ऑफ ए वैक्टर इज वन मॉड्यूलस ऑफ बी वैक्टर इज फोर एंड मॉड्यूलस ऑफ सी वैक्टर इज टू so the key concept involved is key concept is dot product of vectors let's write what we have been given given is modulus of a vector is equal to 1 modulus of b vector is equal to 4 and modulus of c vector is 2 and a vector plus b vector Plus c vector is zero. Also, we have to evaluate mu, which is a vector dot b vector plus b vector dot c vector plus c vector dot a vector. Now we'll look at the expression a vector plus b vector plus c vector dot a vector plus b vector plus c vector. And of course, we know that this would be zero because. Uh, multiplication of uh, the same vector uh, the a square of any vector is square of its modulus and we know that as a vector plus b vector plus c vector is zero a vector plus b vector plus c vector so whole square would also be zero which is written on the left hand side so hence we can say that a vector times a vector plus a vector dot b vector plus a vector dot c vector plus b vector dot b vector Plus b vector dot a vector plus b vector dot c vector plus c vector dot c vector plus c vector dot a vector plus c vector dot b vector is zero. Now what we'll do is we'll take this uh, same terms like a vector dot a vector term, b vector dot b vector term, and c vector dot c vector term on one side. So we'll have a vector dot a vector plus b vector dot b vector. Plus c vector dot c vector, and the rest of the thing which is left is twice of a vector dot b vector plus b vector dot c vector plus c vector dot a vector. Now this is uh, because we know that a vector dot b vector is equal to b vector dot a vector, which is repeated twice in this equation. Similarly, for b vector dot c vector and c vector dot a vector, and of course the RHS would be zero. Now we know that. A vector dot a vector is modulus of a vector square, so this is modulus of a vector square plus b vector dot b vector is modulus of b vector square, and c vector dot c vector is modulus of c vector square plus twice of. This entire expression was basically mu, so I'll just replace mu over here, and the RHS would be zero. Now a vector square is one square plus b vector square is four square plus c vector square is two square. And we'll have our value of mu to be minus two mu is equal to one one plus sixteen plus four, and we should imply that mu is equal to minus twenty one upon two. And we have found the value of our mu. I hope you understood it well, and best of luck.